In this video tutorial, uh, we will learn some of geometric progression. After this tutorial, you will be able to find the sum of geometric progression with finite and infinite number of elements. Uh, like us and subscribe and let's get started. First of all, uh, let's define what is a geometric uh, progression. This is a sequence. Assume, let's fix uh, some number, some number A, and uh, let's write uh, power powers of this number, A to the power 0, A to the power 1, A to the power 2, A to the power 3, and so on a to the power n. And let's uh, assume the sum of these elements. Uh, and let's denote it as Sn. And how to find Sn, the sum of uh, elements of our uh, sequence. And this sequence is called geometric, geometric progression. Progression. Um, let's prove it. Uh, to prove this result, first of all, we have to remember our previous um, special form formula in algebra that looks like x to the power n minus a to the power n. This polynomial, as we know from previous tutorial, uh, is divisible by another polynomial or binomial x minus a and result of this division is equal to some polynomial of degree n minus 1 uh, exactly if you write it this is x to the power n minus 1 plus a times x to the power n minus 2 plus a squared so degree of a will be increasing times x to the power n minus 3 and degrees of x is decreasing plus and so on and last member is a to the power n minus 1 times x to the power n minus n which is equal to x to the power 0 which is 1 and look at this formula this formula is valid and we proved it in our previous tutorial. And if we put x, x such that equal to 1, then we have uh, to the right side of our previous equation, write it as equation uh, 1. Then from equation 1, we have, to the right side of this equation, we have, since x is equal to 1, we have 1 plus a plus a squared plus so on, a to the power n minus 1. And to the left side of our equation, we have 1 minus a to the power n divided by 1 minus a. And that's all. This is the formula for the sum of the first elements of geometric progression. Um, in other words, the other um, representation, how we write this formula is Sn is equal to 1 minus a to the power n, sorry, Sn minus 1, is equal to a minus a to the power n divided by a minus divided by 1 minus a or we can write it um, as sn is equal to 1 minus a to the power n plus 1 divided by 1 minus a This is the formula for the sum of the first n elements of geometric progression. 
Of course, our geometric progression can have infinite number of elements. We have, assume we have a one plus a plus a squared plus a cubed plus and so on, a to the power n plus up until infinity. And assume uh, absolute value of a is less than one. In this case, since our sum is equal to to 1 minus a to the power n plus 1 divided by 1 minus a. And uh, this element, since we have infinite number of elements, will tend to 0. And don't worry if you don't understand it. We will learn limits in our next tutorials uh, when we will learn uh, calculus. But anyway, uh, you have to understand that this member of our equation, which is less than 1, if we take uh, the powers of this number and the power is increasing, in this case, our number is decreasing and tends to 0. So, since this is 0, Resulting formula will be 1 divided by 1 minus a. And this is the formula for the sum of infinite number of elements of geometric progression. That's all. Very easy. Uh, sometimes we can have that... Um, in our geometric progression, the first element is not 1, but some uh, number b. Let's put here b. In this case, in our formula, we have um, here b, and uh, everything else uh, remains the same. Let's give several examples. Example number 1. Assume we have um, a equal to 5. And let's assume the sum of elements of our geometric progression. 1 plus 5 plus 5 squared plus and so on, 5 to the power 10. And using our previous tutorial, oh, sorry, using our previous definition of geometric progression it will be um, it will be this formula for n elements of our uh, geometric progression so we have 1 uh, minus a to the power n plus 1 divided by 1 minus a and we write it like this but here we have a is equal to 5 and n equal to 10. It will be 1 minus 5 to the power 11 divided by 1 minus 5. It will be negative number 1 minus 5 to the power 11 divided by negative number minus 4. And uh, we can write it as 5 to the power 11 minus 1 divided by 4. And this is the answer of our example. Next example, assume uh, we have sum of our next sequence, sequence. 1 plus 1 over 2 plus 1 over 4 and of course 1 over 4 is equal to 1 over 2 squared plus 1 over 8 and this is 1 over 2 to the power 3 plus and so on plus 1 over 2 to the power n. The sum of this 
uh, geometry progression is equal to 1 minus a to the power n plus 1 divided by 1 minus a. And we have a is equal to 1 over 2 and n is as usual n will remain n and it will be 1 minus 1 over 2 to the power n plus 1 divided by 1 minus 1 over 2 1 minus 1 over 2 is 1 over 2 and if we divide by 1 over 2 it will be multiplication by 2 so answer will be 2 times 1 minus 1 over 2 to the power n plus 1. Uh, of course, in this example, we can have infinite number of elements here. Assume here n is tending to infinity. In this case, our example uh, will be 1 plus 1 over 2 plus 1 over 4 plus 1 over 8 and uh, plus and so on 1 over 2 to the power n plus uh, and so on infinite number of elements the sum of this uh, progression will be will be this answer our previous answer but but we have to tend n to infinity in this case this member will tend to zero because we have a number with absolute value less than one and if we increase the power because um, one over two to the power n if we tend n to infinity, we'll tend to zero. If you don't understand this, don't worry. We will learn uh, limits in our next tutorials on uh, calculus. But for the moment, uh, assume that this member will tend to zero. In this case, um, answer will be two. So. sum of this geometric progression is equal to 2. Uh, now we can find the sum of geometric progression with finite or infinite number of elements. It was everything for this tutorial. Like us and subscribe uh, and have a good day.